I'm going to share with you today three tips for making better Instagram content in 2024. So three really simple things you can implement just to up level your content and just to improve what you are putting out there. These are so, so simple, but they have massive impacts. So if you are really wanting to just up level your Instagram game, if you're wanting just a really big boost in terms of engagement, sales, whatever your goals are specifically now with Instagram, here are three tips I would give you to just really up level your game with Instagram. The first thing is using the word I more than the word you, especially if you're a service provider, this is an absolutely golden tip here. Switch up your language to talk more about yourself, which sounds really counterintuitive, but bear with me here. This is so helpful because it just brings life into your content essentially, because we've seen so many posts of the typical value posts talking about things like, for example, how to get 100 followers in a week, how to grow on Instagram. But actually, if you just switch one word in that, it completely changes the tone of the post and it completely changes how likely someone is to actually want to, you know, read this post and actually consume this content essentially. So for example, if we switched up the how to get 100 followers in a week and we just switched that's so super, super simple to how I got 100 followers in a week, how I did this specific thing, how I grew on Instagram, how I signed my next five clients, for example. It is so much easier to actually get someone wanting to follow along, to actually get someone wanting to engage with this piece of content because it's not what we're used to typically seeing here. And I think others really been this big shift now, especially in the industry of, we've seen a lot of these big claims. We've seen almost so many of these, how to get 100 followers in a week, how to sign your next client, that we've seen it all before and we're not really almost paying attention anymore in the way that we used to with those. So really just switching it to talking about how I have done this, how I did this, how I would do this, is such an easy way to actually just grab attention, and just get people really engaged with this post and get them actually reading and actually paying attention because it just adds more life into it essentially. The second thing to do is really prioritize your hooks. This is so important, especially as there's more content going out there, especially as there's more people, you know, following different people in your industry. They're following lots of service providers. It's not just you, unfortunately. So a lot of the times I see people with, they do actually have great content and they have really, you know, great posts which they're sharing, but it's the hook that's really letting them down because they're not actually getting people to read in the first place. No matter how good your post is, if no one's reading, it doesn't matter at the end of the day. So really just focusing in on what is that first line hook gonna be, making it a bold statement, making it something which stops people actually scrolling, grabs their attention and actually hooks them into reading is absolutely gold. So just taking a little second just to think, okay, what is the best way that I can just grab people's attention here? What's the best way I can hook them in with this specific post is gonna actually get you so much more engagement, so much more, you know, um, people actually reading your post and so many more actual sales and clicks on your CTA at the end of the day, um, just from this small shift. So actually making sure you're getting the most out of every post you are posting is really a great way to focus your time and attention in 2024 on Instagram. The third thing is actually to be repetitive. I think this is especially again important nowadays where, you know, there's so many service providers talking about so many different things. The thing that makes you stand out isn't trying to post a new thing every day and trying to be drastically different every day. It is actually by saying the same thing over and over again and having really strong messaging and having a really strong brand. If you think about the people you love the most that you follow online, you can straight away say words or phrases that you associate with them and you know them really well because they say those things and talk about those things over and over and over again and they're really repetitive. So actually, firstly, focus on getting clear on your message and then when you have got clear on your message, really just create content around this and just focus on the same thing, focus on the same area, the same transformation, the same ideal client, just from different angles and just talk about it in different ways. I talk a lot about simplicity and about, you know, making more and working less in your business. I talk about that all the time. I just talk about it in different ways and different ways that you can do that. So actually become known for something. Actually focus on being repetitive with your content and actually sharing the same thing over and over and just sharing it in different ways each time. This has such a bigger impact and it also saves you time as well because you're not trying to reinvent the wheel every single time. You are trying to create a piece of content or create a post. So those are my three tips for creating better Instagram content in 2024. If these have been helpful for you, make sure you give this video a like. Make sure you subscribe as well because I post daily videos to help you grow on Instagram and actually get clients on Instagram as a service provider going into 2024 and what we can do now with the industry. So make sure you subscribe so you do not miss the daily videos and I will see you in the next one tomorrow.